Kia ora, my name is Erin Harrington and I am a lecturer in cultural studies here at the University of Canterbury. Cultural studies isn't really a discipline, it's more of an approach. So in cultural studies we take all of the tools that are at hand to us in the arts and the humanities, including from subjects like sociology and music and media and political science and various other forms of the art, and we apply them in new and interesting ways to a variety of problems. The really good thing about this is that we get to look at culture in all of its diversity, both high culture as well as our low culture, popular culture and the everyday. This means that we get to focus on things like race and ethnicity, class, uh, the relationships between people and animals and the environment, gender and sexuality, as well as other issues pertaining to us in Aotearoa New Zealand, such as decolonisation. Cultural studies and these topics are really important because it allows a really complicated and complex worldview. One of the key things that you get throughout our courses is that we are not interested in simplifying issues down into something that can be easily kind of explained away. Instead, we are interested in understanding the world in all its complexity. And that means you have to have complex, interesting and critical tools. This also means that you can go out into the world and understand these very complex problems in nuanced and interesting ways and be able to offer your own perspective on the problems that you might face in your day-to-day -day life but also in your professional life. Cultural studies, like many of the other subjects in the arts, is really interested in things like writing and uh, argument, uh, rhetoric and critical thinking. But in particular, we offer courses that allow you to develop the skills to attack these very complex critical problems. So yes, you're engaged in critical thinking, but you're also drawing from a really wide skill set and a really diverse subject base to be able to address these complex skills and problems. On top of that, of course, too, you are engaging in creative work, you are being able to bring your own ideas and examples into the work that you do, and it's a wonderful way for you to marry your interest in the world with broader issues and problems. Why study cultural studies at UC? It's the only place that you can do cultural studies as a degree program, uh, and that is as a major or a minor within the BA. Uh, one of the great things that we're able to do is to bring together subjects from 15 different disciplines, uh, including things like sociology, music, media, uh, history, Māori and Indigenous studies, and so on, and you can package them into uh, a degree that is tailored just for you. Now, you can pick and choose uh, subjects in a manner that you see fit, or you can follow one of a series of pathways ways that we've built if you'd like to focus on something more specific. So these include things like uh, gender and sexuality studies, uh, Aotearoa New Zealand studies, uh, human animal studies and studies of the environment and also pop culture studies. <laughs>